That's a good fish, dude. That's a good fish. Oh my goodness. Yes. Told you you were gonna get the biggest fish today. Hello and thanks for tuning in. Smith Lake was an awesome time. We're gonna do a lot of fishing and mainly everything that you see in the frame is actually a fish catch. But the first trip we went down to Smith Lake, I got in touch with my buddy Zach over at ZK Customs. Him and I traveled down to Smith Lake, had an excellent trip. Fair Here warning, is. some of the images are pretty grainy. Zach took the images, sent them to me via text and I put them into the video. I just wanted to say thank you to the customers and supporters of Ben Green Insurance right. Agency. Thank you for your support across the country. On the road. On the road. On the road. Where are we headed, Mr. Ben? Smith Lake. Smith I think we're in Coleman, Alabama at the Ninja Besamachi Grill around town. What's up, Matt? Just showing Anthony where we're going to stay next week. Fish. Oh, that looks like a keeper spot. Is he 12? That's large mouth. Oh, it is? Yeah. Yeah. Know your species. Yep. Did this chase it? <laughs> it may have. I caught him. <laughs> the world will never know. About 14 and a quarter, so you can't keep him, so we can turn him back. There you go. Pretty fish. Ain't gonna bite you. Oh, oh look at that. Fell out. <laughs> I knew I didn't have a good hook in him. That's a good one. All right. How about there you go. You know what your picture with? Yeah. Oh, dude. Dude. Told you. Dude. That's a good one, dude. He just badly hooked. But hooked good enough. That's a really good one. I stay recording. Nice, On the center one. Caught one. There he is. Oh well, gotta go back. Oh yeah. Doing today. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's a nice one. Pretty. Sure is. That ain't right. There it is. Well, the reason we couldn't see my bait is because it was in this little guy's mouth. <sighs> hey, that's a keeper. I think he might be under the slot, but yeah, he wouldn't have helped us. And just no, shrinking that... it down, we just only went to the to the bridge basically and hit a couple spots and. Just shy of 12 pounds. I mean, I'm sure a lot of guys caught them a lot better than that today. There's a ton of boats out here today, but I'm happy about that. I am too. Appreciate it. Zach. Thank, thank you for letting me come with you. Yeah. Anthony's over here telling me he's got uh, something that we're after. Nice, dude. You weighed him? Three and a half, four. That was right after you caught a three? That was right after that three pound spot. Wow, dude. Like next cast right up in there. Good spot. You might want to hit your poles. All righty, boys. This is how you find them. Keep pressing on. That's a tank. A bit of 18. Let's get her back in the water. Looks like 328. Guys, got something a little bit figured out here. Something a little bit figured out here. That one went 328. We're going to have to have... 15 pounds just to be in the top three 17 or 18 will win it so that's the right kind of fish we need gotta go find some more See you, girl. when you wish the tournament was today boom another good one let's throw her on the scale we're running 14 with our smallest at 180 right now
good 17 incher back here thank you fish you give me a lot of confidence heck yeah that is a big spotted bass bub tosh that's for you buddy that's for you dude, dude. jeez dude really <laughs> 194. <laughs> All that for 194. Thanks, Bob. Weighed this guy 198. Let's get her back in the water. Chavy Mike Croft and I were out here, first day of practice. Got the first keeper in the boat. Good job. You might know Mike Croft. He is married to Laura Croft, Tomb Raider. Well, he was before, but they're, uh, it's complicated. Cut one. There we go. Go tell your friends. I'll give you 15% off on home and auto when you bundle. Mike and I are out here, day two of practice, trying to figure something out. We got a couple keepers, I think three of them between the two of us. Nothing to write home about yet. We're on them. Right yeah. No bite, just a soggy feeling. There we go. All right. I like a lot of people like that bait for sure. Oops. Yeah. Dick. Dink! It went tick. There he is. Look at that sucker. That's a good one. Guess we'll be getting out of here too, huh? All right, buddy. All right, that's what we're after. Right there. Good job. Starting to find him. At least he's over two. Yeah. yeah. I thought I got bit. I sure did. That's a good one. Oh, he's foul hooked. Oh, he's a good fish. Now I'm boat flipping. That's a good one. All right, buddy. I'm pretty sure we got a pattern. He ain't gonna weigh much though, that's the problem. But he's a fish. He's a spotty. Yeah. There goes 16. Well, it's a confidence builder. I'm coming. He's hooked pretty good. I've seen him. That's a good fish, dude. That's a good fish. Oh my goodness. Yes. Told you you were going to get the biggest fish today. That is a toad. Great job, Mike. Good in Tennessee. Great job, Mike. 
Bennett Wilson and came back. We were talking about Rachel Uribe, and you got to meet Rachel. And uh, look what happened, Rachel. He caught one. How awesome is that? We're going to weigh it. That's the kind we need for tomorrow, buddy. Always the best rods in the business. Awesome, buddy. All right, let's let her go. Come see us tomorrow, old girl. She tired. She's tired. Thank you, sir. That was a pleasure fishing with you. Great job today. We learned quite a bit and uh, good luck out there. Yes, you too. So we just met basically through the Phoenix boats uh, looking for a link and, you know, text messaged it and he was able to practice with me and he really helped me out. So That's keep that in mind. Times. All right, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Good luck. Tournament day is finally here. If you could do me a favor, just hit that subscribe button. I drew Chris Woolsiver and this is Chris's first tournament. Hopefully you enjoy this next section as much as possible. Well, yeah, we know the outcome of this tournament is already written. The story for our lives is already in place. We'll figure it out. I mean, we might, but yeah, you don't have a shot over here, so you're wide open in, in any motor, pro-am. I just put him in the center here. Yes, sir. And then you can take care of him. Good job, dude. Good job, though. Hey, you, f you found one. Mm -hmm. Chris's first tournament fish. Oh, look at that little one. All right, buddy. Are we flipping on a hook set like that? My goodness. It wasn't a fish, but geez, if it would have been. This is my magic worm, and it worked two days in practice like fire. Finally. He's small. Sorry. That's a keeper though. Yeah. All right. That's a confidence builder, buddy. Nice. Now you gotta do that over because it sucked. <laughs> so, if it was still closed, I wouldn't be able to have time to hit the decoy. Right. Uh, I don't know. I think he's gonna be in the slot. There we go. I don't think he's gonna make it. Right at 14. All righty. What just happened, buddy? There you go. How about that guy? I know, right? Finally. Yes, sir. That's a nice large mouth. Good job trying to get at that net. I just seen him. First keeper. Good job. Thank you. Nice. About time, huh? All right. Look at the color on that thing. It's beautiful. Great time fishing with you. I had a blast. I appreciate it. Absolutely. I'm just... Number one. <laughs> Get the double chin out of the way. <laughs> You're doing what? I'm just playing a sad violin over here for myself. Didn't do too well. <laughs> Mr. Ben Green from Jasper, Tennessee, bringing us three to the scales. <laughs> it's a tough, tough day on y'all, man. He's got three for the scales that are going to go five pounds and 13 ounces. Thanks for bringing some in. We'll get all them points for those fish. Wolcifer, that's right. Guntersville, Alabama co-angler is bringing us one for his first time on the scales. We're glad to have you. Got one out of the back of the boat, and it's going to go two pounds and two ounces. God bless. Thank you for watching. I wanted to give a couple thank you shout outs. Kevin Sigalito holding the fort down at Ben Green Insurance Agency. I was at the tournament. Brian was at the Chicagoland show. Jazz at Last Chance Performance Marine. She said, I think I've talked to you every single day in the last two weeks. That's right. We had some issues with the Skeeter. Got it all tuned up, ready to fire out there for tournament day. 
Stacy Teeters for coming over here and helping me out with those issues and, uh, and putting uh, a wrench on TKO them. Tungsten. If you yeah, don't have somebody buy tungsten you... from, look them up. You'll be glad you did. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you at the next one.